Did he defeat at home today? Just your thoughts on the performance? Yeah, overall, disappointed, Gareth. Um, I've said to the players the importance of getting back to winning ways, especially at home. Um, I really felt for the fans today. You know, we've not been at home for nearly two months. Um, we lost, or they lost out over the Christmas period coming and watched their team and, and I wanted the boys to go and put on a, a real good performance day and, and, and like we got off to a great start after 45 minutes, eh, sorry, in the first 45 minutes we were 1-0 up after 5 minutes with Big George scoring his first goal for the club. We then go on and then do well in the first half, we we make some other good op other opportunities, sorry, we don't capitalise them um, and it's basically a carbon copy of the last game against them, I gave you the second half, we just don't turn up, um, really disappointed. I've told them that after the game, it's it's no it's not my own team that's saying tough for me, it's not the way I set my team up, it's not the way I get my team to play. Um, and that's that's the thing that hurts me the most tonight. Ah, it was obviously a dream start for George, getting that goal in the first four minutes, like you say. You must have been confident going going from that and, and pushing on. Yeah, listen, I thought we get an early goal, we'd have pushed them on. I thought we'd have, we'd have, we'd have, we'd have, we did take the game to, to a broth in the first half, but the second half, listen, the goals are really a few of them are free errors for, for certain players, um, but there's a certain players in the team that think they're better than they are, and, and listen, frankly, they're no, um, and, and they need to they need to learn that quick um, and just do the basics what they're asked. Um, but listen, but I'll deal with that. I'll deal with that going forward. Um, but in the main, really disappointed overall, Gareth, for 90 minutes today. You said as well, it's almost the same as the last time against Arbroath. You know, you've gone in ahead at the break, and then the second half, it just wasn't good enough. No, nah, it was wrong. Just simple, simple passes that people weren't making, yeah. errors that were, were were uncalled for. But it's, it's players putting themselves under under pressure for for doing um, daft things with the, with the ball. Um, but listen, we 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 got to try and galvanise ourselves um, and that starts again on Monday um, because listen the amount of times I praised the players this season is there for everyone to see but today is just not acceptable um, and I'll not accept that going forward but we need to try and get motivation or a, a break for somewhere to, to try and kick start our season again. Uh, you say about getting motivation you know way to Inverness next week in the next week how would you sit back and assess the start to the year especially after coming off such a great run? Yeah listen it's, 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 it's there for everyone to see it's not been great but Again, within that, there's been errors that it's out with our, our um, gasp, if you want to put it. Um, so, like I say, we, we're just unfortunate we're on, the, we're on the, the losing run at the moment, but we'll, we'll change that, we'll, we'll sort that. It's up to myself and the staff to, to, to get that sorted. And, and like I say, we're, we're hurting as much as, as the players are. Um, but I'm just, overall, I'm, I'm really disappointed, Gareth, today. Really, really disappointed.